course. As soon as I get a chance to film, I have to mulch trees outside. Seriously? Hello and welcome to my channel. I apologize for the annoying noise that's happening outside. There's a truck that's trimming trees and mulching them going down the road and it decided that it needed to stop and mulch the trees right outside my house. So I'm going to do this anyway. If the audio is really bad, I'll refilm it, but hopefully I might be able to reduce background noise or something. I don't know, but I'm going to try this anyway. So today I am sharing with you what's in my everything bag. This is the same bag I've used for the past few years for my everything bag. Now, my everything bag is what I call my just in case. It's like all essentials that I have in my purse, which just makes switching bags a whole lot easier because I switch bags a lot just because sometimes I need to take my computer with me to work, so I need a bigger bag, so I just switch everything out. Sometimes I just want a little shoulder, but anyway point is, I change bags a lot. Um, and I call this my everything bag. I've heard it called um, a just in case bag. I've called it, I've heard it called a walking pharmacy. I've heard it called uh, a whole bunch of things. I call it an everything bag. I've kind of updated it and uh, taken some things out and put some things in, etc. So I'm going to show you what it is I carry around in my purse all the time. This thing is chinched full, pretty, pretty close. And I wanted to change out what bag I, which pouch I use, but nothing works as well as this. Like it's just the perfect size and it's like a little kind of cube. It's not a cube, but you know what I mean? It like fits down, I can fit it this way. It's, it's just, it, it's the perfect size, perfect bag. This is Orla Kylie for Target that I got back when we had Target. So that was what, three years ago? Maybe even more. I love it. I also have one like this, which I did use as an everything bag for a long time. Uh, but then the bag that I was carrying was smaller, so I switched out of this. I might switch back to this. I'm not positive. Um, just because it's skinnier and this one's a little fatter, but uh, hmm, I might switch back. I don't know because I really like this one. Um, and I just like the colors and stuff, so we'll see. But I'm going to show you everything that I have, and then if I do decide to switch bags, I'll add it in at the end of how I organize it, but the stuff will be the same. So I open up the bag, and you can see it's pretty chinched in there. Like everything is it's kind of standing up, so it doesn't really shift around, and it works out well. So the right on top, I have headphones. Uh, I know most people are like Bluetooth headphone people now, but I still like good old cord headphones because I can use it with my computer. I can use it. I can still use it with my phone. I don't have a new phone that has the just Bluetooth only. Uh, but I just I like to have old-fashioned headphones. You never know. Um, so they're in there. Uh, a bigger thing that takes up a lot of room is I have a pack of these. Uh, Baby Boo Bamboo Whites. Um, I found a pack of, I think five of these individual packs at Winners. And this is the last one of the yellow one. They changed the packaging recently. I bought a pack. Where are they? Um, no, I have one more of these left. That are, they're white. Like this is the new packaging. Um, but anyway, they're $5 for one, two, three, four, five packs. Um, and there's 12 in there and they're like good size. And I tell you, this comes in super handy when I'm getting groceries and the kids have, you know how they have the fruit for the kids um, basket when you first go in. And then they end up sticky if they have the clementines or whatever. So this is really good. I don't know how many times I've reached for the wipes that are in here. And they're just so tiny. Like look how cute that is. So that, uh, I have a tampon. And surprisingly enough, I rarely use the tampon that I have in my everything bag, but I have it for if somebody else needs it. Because, I don't know, it just seems to be like the one that's in here always ends up going to someone else. Um, I have my granny pack of pills. The girls make fun of me at the studio. But I have two hair elastics on there. Cause I used to have it on a piece of cardboard, but the uh, it was just getting too 
messed up. So I have two hair ties that are just wrapped around my little pill caddy, which I got at the container store when I was in Florida for 99 cents. Price tag still on it. Uh, and one has Tylenol. The other one has um, Adasol 8 because I have bad back. And Adasol 8s, uh, because there's codeine in them, are great for coughs. Co codeine is great for cough. And this is back pain pills. And um, in the bottom of my back pain pills, I have this tiny little pack of, if I get it out, screwdrivers. These have come in handy so many times, I can't even tell you. Um, they're great for glasses and stuff. I got this in a Christmas cracker, like a Christmas cracker. Um, and anyway, they have come in handy so many times and um, yeah. I had to like put batteries in the back of a makeup mirror when I was at the theater one time and you know, needed to screw on and I did it with that. So yeah. So that is my little pill box with my hair elastics. And who's texting me? I feel important all of a sudden. Oh, Cassandra. Oh, thanks babe. Uh, okay. I have a hand cream. This is the Body Shop Almond Hand and Nail Manicure Cream. I really like this like I rarely care about like hand creams like whatever hand creams hand cream but this one is really good and it's a perfect size um, this was in a uh, Edmund calendar from the body shop so that's why it's a perfect little size I have this um, the healthy deodorant by la vanilla la, la vanilla la vanilla okay um, it's not great, like, working deodorant. Like, it's it's, it's not going to keep you stink-free all day long. But, oops, that was a good catch. Too bad you missed that. Um, but it's good in a pinch. Like, it's a good little freshen up thing. It's good. And it's, I, that's the only reason I bought it was for the size. Because um, the way that it's round, it just fits down there perfectly, rather than the travel size, like, dove or degree or whatever they just are a little bit weirder shaped I don't know it works it's I've had it for a long time and it's still good so that's that um, I have a lip balm this is just a Nivea soothing care uh, lip balm you know out of the mail I can put some of that on actually so yeah you know lip balm uh, I have one of these. Now, I have some makeup things in here. I love a good makeup mini. And the whole reason is to put them in here. Um, I love, this is what I'm actually wearing right now, the Burt's Bees Lip Shimmer. And this one's in Fig. Fig and Plum are my favorite ones. But I've been wearing these for years. I love them. It's basically a tinted lip balm, but it's got a little bit more color. Even though it says lip shimmer, eh, it's not much shimmer to it, but I have one of those in there. I have a sample Smashbox Camera Ready BB Cream. It's just a little sample one, uh, which is basically what I've been wearing lately anyway, and I really have to get a new one, mind me. I have a mini Makeup Forever uh, excessive lash mascara. This is the one I wear every day, which is why I have a mini because I uh, found a mini with um, an eyeliner at Winners and I bought it because I just love that mascara. I have two of these little mini lipsticks um, by Stowaway, which came in a pop sugar box back when I used to get those when they weren't ex exorbitantly expensive. Um, and they're just perfect colors. This one is um, muted plum and I think the other one is cranberry they were like a, it was a December one it was like a Christmas themed yeah cranberry and muted plum and so this one is great for like night out um, red lip and this is a regular one and for the other lips uh, makeup stuff I have a, a concealer this one I had in my mini everything bag that I had um, for a smaller purse but um, I don't really use it that often. It's, I don't even know where it is right now. Um, I don't really use it that often, I'm gonna throw it around. So 
I needed an another concealer for this one, so I just moved it over. Um, so I also have in the bottom two of these little snappy clips. Um, I find my hair sometimes gets unruly and I just like do the little clippies and I also have them in there for Violet because her hair is something to control. So I have those, I have two of those in there. I have contact lenses. I don't wear contact lenses. Why do you have contact lenses in your bag? Well, I have these for Steve. My husband wears contact lenses. So I always have these in here just in case for him. Um, I wear glasses a lot of the time. I don't need them all the time, but I wear them a lot of the time. So I've got a cleaning cloth for my glasses. Um, I also have in here a Ziploc bag. This is um, like a travel one. It's like pretty heavy duty plastic and it's with a sliding zip. But uh, you never know when you're gonna need a Ziploc bag. And I tell you, this has come in handy a lot. Not this one, but you know. Um, I've gone to places and had leftovers from lunch or something like that. And it's just, it was easy to pop it in a Ziploc bag instead of having to carry around a plastic container or that kind of stuff. So. Anyway, that's why that's in there. And it's like totally flat against the side. You don't even know it's there. And so then that's the main part. Then I have, there's these pouches in the back there that I have things stuck in. So a lot could go in here. Um, so if you can see, I have some safety pins attached there. So, and on the safety pins, I have um, these little, where is it? These little like black hair ties is very tiny black hair ties so that two of those there for violet and I also have some bobby pins there uh, for her hair or mine so uh, yeah so I have safety pins attached there in this the larger like flat pocket here I have a lens cleaner uh, for glasses or uh, my camera or my phone or whatever, but it's just it's just a wipe like it's a one-shot deal So uh, that's why I have the other cloth in there just because if I use that then I mean I have more I can refill it but refill it replace it um, If I need to I have this small little ziplock bag of band-aids um, A couple of like regular ones some blister block ones, and I think there's some Mickey Mouse ones in there um, so that's really flat that goes in there. I've got uh, some tweezers, tweezer man tweezers, uh, because I find if I'm in the car for any length of time, uh, like waiting to pick somebody up or whatever, and I'm in the passenger seat, uh, even on long drives, I like to pluck my eyebrows when I'm in the car because the light is really good. Like, because you get natural light. And anyway, I have terrible light in my house, so. And the last thing in that little slip pocket is a mirror that can stand up it's got this like you know it's a mirror and it's got the little thing that you can make it stand up which also came in a christmas cracker so you know those things you get the good crackers you get some good stuff um okay and then there's like this tube shaped one there and in that one i have the eyeliner that went with the uh, makeup forever mascara and I have another <laughs> Makeup Forever mascara. Why do I have two? Yeah, I have two. One's fatter than the other. Why do I have two? Okay, there's no need of two. There's no need of that. Um, okay, so that's in the tube thing. And then this other smaller slit flat one, I have a little pair of scissors. Now, they're not gonna cut much, mind you. They're you know, it came with a sewing kit, so like they're not gonna cut through wire or anything drastic. But you know, in a pinch, that's not gonna focus at all, is it? Nope, not gonna focus. Anyway, you get the point. They're like little scissors. Um, they're fairly like, they're not too flimsy, but yeah, you're not cutting much with those things. But they're there. Um, also in that little pouch, this little slit thing, is this pocket knife. Now. It's not like a pocket knife as, you know, most pocket knives are, but it's just this little silver thing and it has a, like a knife. So, you know, cut some cheese and open your bottle of wine because there's a bottle opener. So you got like your slice your cheese and open your wine and file your nails. I don't know. That sounds like a fun night. 
Um, and this also has this one that you, I, I don't even know. I don't know what that's for, but I have it. So yeah, just in case. Uh, also down in here in that little spot is a nail clipper and a nail file. So I have just little nail clippers and uh, like an emery board nail file. And that, I believe, does it. That's all it is in. So um, I might put all this now that it's out in the other bag and see if I'm going to use that one instead now. Oh. Let's see. Might. I might. I don't know. Maybe? Should I? Yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll get back. Hang on. So I switched it out and not totally sure if I'm going to keep it or not. I might put it back in the other one. But I am going to try it out like this tonight. I have a rehearsal tonight, so I might go and take this and see if it works. But anyway, in this one over here, flat smish, I have the Ziploc bag, the headphones, the baby wipes, my glasses case, uh, the hair clips, and uh, Steve's contacts. In the middle floating pouch, I have the uh, makeup, like the concealer, lipsticks, lip gloss, um, the... BB cream, all that stuff. Uh, the deodorant, hand cream, uh, lip balm, and the uh, pill case with the hair elastic. So that's all kind of standing up in the middle there. And then on this side, I basically had the exact same thing as I had in the other one. So I'm actually going to try this out in this one. And it's, it's definitely easier to access the things out of this than the smaller one. But um, it depends on the bag I'm carrying. As you can see, there's definitely a difference in the size. So anyway, I'm going to try this out with this one and see how we do tonight when I take it and see if it fits in my bag, etc. Um, if you carry around something similar, what do you carry in yours? I'd love to know. I'd love to know if I'm forgetting something I should have in here. And yeah, so I hope you're having a great day and uh things are great with you where you are and you have spring because we don't and don't forget to subscribe and see what else i get up to i got some fun things coming up I'm so anyway thanks for watching have a great day bye